Agriculture is a traditional mainstay of Cambodian economy. Planting and harvesting a crop is available throughout the whole year. 70% of land in Cambodia is comprised of endless horizon. The lower zone of the land is filled with water in the rainy season. When the waters leak out, the farming starts. Farmers then just have to sow the seeds. They do not use any pesticides or fertilizers. Even without it, harvest is very good. So our team decided to feel and experience Cambodian farming. With the help from the coordinator, we met farmer's family. The family gave us a big welcome. We tried to give some help to the farmer for planting a cane. He said uh, the land is hard, so we must use your power. <laughs> power, power, power. Yeah. <laughs> we not only planted the cane, but also helped with harvesting a fully grown cane. <laughs> Very uh, fascinating experience we had. Mm -hmm. So what we did was uh, we plant the can, right? Can we plant the can? We cut some can and we tried eating some can. Uh, we we really liked it. It was very sweet and watery, so we really liked it. But however, it kind of broke my heart because uh, the weather wasn't so good. So the all all the harvest for can, corn, and the rice wasn't good for this year because in Cambodia, like all the harvest is in. They do it by natural, no water planting, so just they do natural weather. So we, we kind of felt really bad for bad weather. So I hope it kind of rains more so they can harvest more. Uh... In places, it is not hard to see the picture of king and buildings that symbolize the Buddhism. There aren't many high-rise buildings in the city, but rapid development and constructions are in progress. Even within the city, gap between rich and the poor or gap between towns are easily seen. For Cambodian, we could see the culture and the lifestyles are developed around family. One of the students we teach invited us to have dinner with their family. So we had a chance to feel and experience the Cambodian family culture. The name of the student who invited us was Mana and her family gave us big welcome with beautiful smile and tasty foods. Thank you.